It was time for the town of Lake Wanasink to have its 100-year anniversary party. George knew 100 was a lot because he once ordered 100 boxes of donuts accidentally. The man with the yellow hat asked George to give invitations to all their friends. George could fix that. That's when George learned how windy it is in a moving car. Can you imagine? It took the town a hundred years to complete that. Oh, folks will go absolutely wild when they see all hundred stars on the anniversary jubilaria. How wild would they go when they saw no stars? George had to tell the man about what happened. Just the guy we need. Can you come help with the costumes? Sure. George, do you mind staying here and helping with the anniversary jubilaria? Uh. Thanks. Ow. George would need to fix the anniversary jubilaria himself before anyone was disappointed. <laughs> A good place to start was where the stripes flew out of the car. was. Yeah! George already had eight stripes. One more made nine. Now he only had to find one more stripe. Now the anniversary jubilaria will be unveiled even earlier. Right after the kite flying. Uh -huh. After the kite flying? When was the kite flying? was now. George had no time left. Hey, George, did you see my kite? I found a great tail on the ground right in the yard. <gasps> there it was. When Allie reeled in her kite, everything would be OK. <gasps> Look, an eagle! wanted for its nest. The eagles have a nest on top of Mount Neverclimb. Do you know why they called it Mount Neverclimb? Uh -uh. Because no one could ever climb it. Uh. So how could a little monkey get up there? In just a minute, we'll be unveiling the Anniversa Jubilaria, now with 100 hard-earned stars. <laughs> 10 stripes with 10 stars makes 100 stars. Phew. Wow, everyone I've ever known is here, but not George. He's gonna miss the big 100. Oh, sorry. But we can't wait anymore. Happy 100th anniversary! Yeah! <laughs> uh, oh, uh, George? Uh, careful. Mr. Quint wouldn't want a speck of dirt on those. <laughs> this was about the hardest George had ever worked on something no one would ever know about. George had had a great day. Still, even counting by tens, 100 was an exhausting number. <laughs> <laughs> 